Hey welcome, to another After Effects tutorial. Let's see what we are going to create today. Open After Effects, start with new project. Create new composition. Let's rename it to main comp. And keep default settings, and hit OK. Now, right click and create new text layer. Now, align this text to center. Cool. Now, right click on text layer, and pre-compose it. Let's rename it. Right click, and select new solid layer. Now, go to effects and presets, and search for gradient tramp. And drag it to this solid layer. Now change the start and end color. Now select this star tramp point, and place it to center. Select end ramp point, and place it somewhat here. Cool. Now change ramp shape to radial ramp. Now select this, right click and pre-compose it. Rename it to effect 1. Now again, right click and pre-compose this same layer. Rename it to Effect 2. Cool. Now go to Effects and Presets, and search for Turbulent Displace. And drag it on this Effect 1 pre-comp. Change complexity to 1.5%. Now search for CC Mr. Mercury and drag it to this pre-comp player. Change its radius X to 220. Radius Y to 230. Producer to 1154. Longevity to 3. Gravity to 2. Resistance to 0.40%. Change animation type to fire. Also, change blob birth size to 3%. And blob death size to 0.50%. Now stretch this time navigator end. Just like that. Now on 18th frame, click on this stopwatch and create keyframe and change birth rate value to 0 now on 20th frame i'll create keyframe with value to 0.4 now i'll move this time indicator to somewhat here and change its value to 0 cool now click on this main comp click on this project tab now Drag this effect 1 pre-comp on this timeline. Now search for CC glass. And drag it to this effect 1 pre-comp. Now explore surface, and set bump map to effect 2 layer. And change property to alpha. Cool. Let's preview this. Awesome! Here you have created liquid typography inside After Effects. 
As this project is created using pre-compositions, we can easily drag any logo, or any image file. And it will apply to it easily. Cool! If this tutorial helped you, press the like button, and subscribe for more new contents every week. See you in next tutorial, stay tuned.